All right, we're back here on overtime, and I'm going to ask the questions that people have written in. Uh, Bill, is this country really as dumb as you say? I do always say that. <laughs> or is it just getting meaner? Oh, it's getting meaner and dumber. <laughs> But definitely meaner. I mean, when you see those Republican debates and people cheering for executions and, you know, hating gay soldiers and... Uh, but that... Uh, you, yeah. you think that's meaner than 100 years ago? That I don't know, because I'm not a historian. You may be right. Yeah. They're, I think, they're, I think we all... There's two things that are almost always true. One is that the world keeps getting better, and two is the people always think it's getting worse. Yeah. And that... Uh, it's very... When I look back at, like, my dad <laughs> looking at... 1970, you know, where uh, they've shot students at Kent State. The president is legally crazy. Uh, they are <laughs> Until desperately it's money. The wars are, are, are is going on like crazy in Vietnam. There's no end to anything. The inflation is through the roof. It just looks like it might look worse yeah. now, and maybe we just got older. There's a new book out about this, about how people... Just what you're saying. They think it's getting worse, but actually... When you look at what was going on in the 20th century, there are fewer people starving. Yeah, there are fewer people dying at war. I mean, war those are all right. good things. Right. We, bad things happening now. To, you know, bad things happening now. But you have to look at the big picture. I mean, no polio. But I actually end of argument. I actually don't think it's because people are getting better. I think our oh no, of course, of our course. Of course, I miss of course they're not getting better. <laughs> no, institutions yeah. restrain us more. But I, I just think, like, you know, they always say the police are the thin blue line. If you take them away, God knows what would happen. I agree. I don't. I think I, people are if, really good. You think people are really good? Way good, yeah. And human Whoa. nature... Like vast, vast that is such bullshit. That is crazy. Vast majority yeah. of people If you took away the police, it would be absolute... But you know... Tooth and... Uh, it right. would be the red claw. I do. do you, I even, agree. even the pastor yeah, right. agrees with me. But, uh, but, yeah. Between two atheists, here but, I am. You know, <laughs> I, uh, I, I go out and talk about the book, and people raise their hands and say, if there is no heaven or hell, uh, what's to stop me from just raping and killing anybody I want? And I always go, who's on your list? Because my list of people to kill <laughs> is zero. I think everybody's list of people... Have, do you have someone on your list that you would actually kill? Oh. Just, <laughs> whole list. just, just on this panel. Yeah. No. <laughs> no. Oh, but, boy. My point is, <laughs> and it's not you. Thank you. And you say people, people are you. really bad. You think that without God, they would just kill everybody? No, I don't. Who's on your list? No, I don't think people would kill everybody if there were no God. I think people but, are really but, good. But it, it is all relative. I mean, I don't, I think people are good. The problem is none of us is good enough to meet God's standard. That's well, God's standard, yeah. yeah. But yeah. not kill other people. Here's, here's, here's what it is. I, 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 think, I think people are situational. When you put them in a situation where they can commit heinous crimes, they would. Uh, I, I, I use the example Not of... Not without help. Do you, do you remember the uh, Nazi guard Ivan the Terrible, John Demjanjuk? He was... Dated him, but didn't know him well. <laughs> but yes, of course. Okay, well, this guy was... I mean, it was, it was a bit debated whether he really was Ivan the Terrible, but they think he really he should, was. Yeah. Okay, so he was during the war, the World War II, when it was okay to torture people and kill them. He was a vicious Nazi prison guard. Okay, fine, he did that. Then after the war, he slipped out of the country and for the next 40 years worked as an auto worker in Ohio. Courteous, on time, excellent worker, didn't bother anybody. Great quiet pension and day. benefits. Yeah. Pension yeah. and benefits, <laughs> exactly. So in other words, when the situation prohibited him from acting like a, yes. like a, a savage, he did not. And but I you, think that's people. But you also When have they to could remember, be Nazi prison guards, lots of them. You were. start naming people who have done horrendous things, and then I'll name the six billion alive now who haven't. And again, it's because they didn't have the opportunity, or if they were put in that position. So. Really? I don't think so. I think that we've... If we've they got, were marauding they're, they're, savages outside your door, the, you'd protect your family. There's certainly the Mil Milgram experiments and all that stuff that shows us right. a very negative thing. There's no doubt that that's on your side. Right. But that is not proof that everyone is bad. But if you're going to play a game, whether it's majority, baseball or soccer or business or life, there need to be rules and referees. It's just like we all need to agree on what are the rules of the game. Yeah. There and, are, but some rules have to come from your heart, and some rules and, have and, to come from too much extent, regulation, if that's what you're and saying. And to some extent, human nature has been the same for thousands. Well, of course, it's, we it's have a good time to evolve on that. I, I, yeah. That's right, and rules don't make anybody any holier. They're a restrainer exactly. against he's evil, a, no. but they don't make us holier. Uh, not quite. Oh, <laughs> no. Not quite. But police forces do. They do. You but they don't make you better inside. They change your behavior, but they don't change the inside. 
so the wrong part. When the, when the police uh, sat, decided to sit home in 1992 here, we had riots. I and we would have them again if they did. Okay, do you believe that sex appeal is a factor in how news corporations choose their female anchors? Hmm. I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Exactly. Now if they could just do that with stewardesses. Whoa. Uh, <laughs> oh, you're, boy. You're so easy to make, that, make me make that sound. Okay. What did you think of the president's timing for directing the Justice Department's crackdown on medical canna cannabis dispensaries? Is this a diversion? A diversion? Why, did he invade Cambodia? <laughs> He's invading America. It's, it's, it's I mean, disastrous. I thought it was awful. The, I mean, you know, I, you I, look, I'm already holding my nose to vote for him because of what he did with the Bush tax cut. If I, if I have to hold something else, <laughs> prohibition I think work. we should look. It's just that simple. I think we should have an honest debate. The marijuana laws should be liberalized, but they shouldn't be done under the guise that everybody is getting medical marijuana. Well, Some people need medical marijuana, exactly, yeah. but most of that is just Why can't the, the rest in California. Of us have party marijuana? Cares, no, no. Let, let's, let's actually let's actually do it rather than have this. I agree. This fake fake medical reason. marijuana. Yeah, I, I, I agree. No, I've never yeah. had any marijuana, a sip of alcohol in my life. Whoa. But I want everybody to be able to. If you're not able to put what you want in your body, you're not living in a free yeah, society. Yeah, but let's do it through the front. Right. I want people to have that, yeah. that right. freedom. Right. And that's from someone who uh, may be the only one on the panel. Is a sip of alcohol ever? Uh, Jack Daniels ice cream, the that's old, about it. The only one. No, okay, I haven't even had that. So but it's not, because, it's not because I think it's sinful, okay? Oh, I'm an because, atheist so I don't okay. do it, so yeah. you don't have to make yeah. the argument. I, mean, I have other reasons, but I don't think it's sinful. <laughs> and what about when Catholics drink the blood with, that it's really wine? Well, that's, really that's one of those strange teachings mm. I was talking about. Uh, <laughs> in, uh, that's not in the Bible. That's nasty business, Commander. Nasty. Well, business. <laughs> yeah, we do, we do Welch's grape juice at our church. You'd love that a lot better, okay? And you uh, also have the product. Well, I placement. think the two of you could have a separate show. I do too. <laughs> I think we could have a, a morning show. I just let's we'd, do we'd, it. We'd, we'd, no, be, no. we'd be like Kathy Lee, and the, you know, no. we'd get a little bomb. Yeah, no. I think it's a. Uh, <laughs> I think it's a buddy cop movie. That's right. We, yeah, that's right. It's, He's an atheist. <laughs> He's a Christian. But they're both cops. <laughs> All right, we gotta go. Thank you very much.